My name is Dr. Bradley Smith. I run a physical medicine rehab clinic at a, a large family medical group. Uh, I've been practicing for uh, about 12 years now. Uh, physical modalities, um, joint mobilizations, uh, neuromuscular re-education, we've, we've, we've done all those types of activities uh, at our clinics. Uh, normally we're utilizing just a, a simple uh, electric stim uh, modality with uh, moist hot packs with our patients. Uh, we've heard about uh, and read some uh, interesting uh, periodicals and, and documents about stimulation with uh, uh, laser. And so uh, we thought we'd bring it into our environment and use it on real life patients and, uh, and, and just see the, the benefits that it would bring to our, to our clientele. Uh, we've seen some amazing results uh, uh, almost immediately. Uh, one example, we have an uh, individual who had a, uh, a, 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 she was attacked by a dog, had some uh, large, uh, large uh, uh, bites into her lower extremity, which uh, uh, you know, lost a lot of, uh, of uh, blood supply, lost a lot of nerve intervention, a lot of damage to, to muscle tissues, and uh, she presented, uh, obviously, uh, ambulating with a walker. Uh, she has had foot drop. Uh, we had seen the patient for approximately six visits doing our normal treatment plan with that type of patient. Stimulation, heat, and some, uh, and some exercises. Uh, I believe we got to about five visits before we decided to, to introduce the to, uh, to the patient. Uh, immediately, uh, after probably no more than three visits, uh, the patient reported her foot drop gone. Uh, we've never seen, I've personally never seen anything like that, the response to a treatment, a particular treatment. Uh, uh, we isolated just that with her uh, on those three visits and uh, uh, since then have increased some of the activity with her. Uh, she claims that she's having uh, uh, more sensation, less pain. Um, she now walks with no ambulatory device uh, in a small amount of time uh, I could probably describe within a uh, you know three week four week period amazing I was expecting uh, uh, um, exactly probably what I would receive from uh, a normal stimulation device uh, however not just with that case but with multiple cases I've seen uh, quite a difference uh, uh, in the immediate uh, uh, comments from patients and actual uh, immediate outcomes. Uh, increased range of motion within knees and or shoulders. Uh, might I add just a few visits. Uh, obviously the, the decreased pain, I, I think we, we, we kind of see that across the board. It's the actual outcomes that, that are different. You know, the, the increased strength, the increased range of motion, uh, not just the, uh, the decrease in pain. You know, the, the things that really matter are uh, true objective outcomes and, and we've seen that using the neuron. We all have to be held accountable in the, in the now and in the future for uh, healthcare growth and uh, so you have to uh, you have to show uh, improvement. You can't just uh, have people come to your clinic and treat them and treat them and treat them and be satisfied with that. Uh, we have to we have to show uh, improvement. We'll probably have to show improvement in order to be reimbursed and so with that being said Utilizing a, a particular tool in your clinic to, to establish that, to establish that protocol, uh, will create a successful environment, uh, not only a successful monetary environment as far as getting reimbursed from your insurance carriers, but uh, as for the patient as well. Uh, the idea of any patient that comes to see us is not to harbor them for uh, months. You know, we want to get them back on their feet uh, as quickly as possible. And uh, General Lynn has given us the ability to do so. Right now, we're, we're currently uh, uh, just doing the TENS, now uh, utilizing the TENS uh, as the monetary reimbursement. Uh, we have the uh, luxury of doing so at, at our clinic only because of our, our patient volume. I think once we've now gotten past this trial period with uh, some of the patients as far as outcomes, now we can try to drill into the, uh, the financial aspect. You know, uh, uh, I believe now that we can see that the patient see a huge benefit in it, we know other patients will too and can implement a, a possibly a cash program uh, uh, into uh, our future treatment plans. They will see the benefit.